think for a moment. What was it that you wished you had learned at school? There are many responses, but most people feel that they simply failed to evolve to meet today's needs and demands, and they regret that they settled for ordinary. Growing up from childhood to adulthood is an extraordinary journey. So much has been written about the development of children, and popular psychology focuses on personal growth during adulthood. But what about adolescence? Those high school years that shape the adults of the future. According to UNICEF, advances in neuroscience reveal that the adolescent brain is still a work in progress, offering a crucial second window of opportunity to influence the development of children in their second decade of life. During this period, they are able to unlearn and relearn behaviors that support their transition into becoming fully functioning adults. Traditional schooling teaches numerous age-old subjects of maths and science, life sciences, social sciences, and technology. And while these are important, kids today are also growing up in a new age where they need new skills. Currently, two major milestones are to be reached during high school. So, how are we transforming our education system to meet the needs of these learners in a world where they can access any information at the touch of a button? What else should we be teaching them? How about real-life skills like management, sustainable development, and being a true leader in an ethical environment, or even just learning that happiness is internally driven? Children aren't born with these skills; they are born with the potential to develop them. The full range of abilities continues to grow and mature through the teen years and into early adulthood. Edu development has done just that. We focus on skills that traditional schools never did. With the COVID-19 pandemic, we stand at the brink of a new normal. We need to reimagine education and grab the opportunity for real change. More than ever, students graduating will face the daunting task of finding jobs in a changing landscape, and they need exposure to ways of becoming more employable and effective. Right now, school is necessary, but it is incomplete. We need to grow ourselves and learn to have new ways of looking at the world. Success, happiness, and security come from growing your potential. Everybody should learn self-confidence, self-esteem, how to improve their self-image, how to make better decisions, negotiate better deals, and entrepreneurship to determine their independence. In other words, everybody has the right to be extraordinary to launch themselves. To be. Edu developed.